G, like Nick, like Strand. Yeah. That dude was perfect. That dude was so fine. I don't know how, I don't even know how I got it. The nigga just said he was like, I got some shit.
let them know how you got started in, in music because you got a couple a couple of Shit, Dolo. Yeah. I had dropped. I had dropped a tape called uh, "Trapping the Rapping." I had dropped like three, four videos, and then uh, my dog TP with the Superior Circle. You know what I'm saying? He, he kept trying to fuck with me, but I was trying to do it by myself. Yeah. On that man, I don't want no nigga to help me. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 I do this shit on my own. So, bro, like for like a year, then you can do it, bro. Just, just tap in. I was like, nah, I'm gonna do this shit Dolo. You feel me? Yeah. And after a while, I'm like, man, fuck it. I got somebody that's trying to put a little bag behind the nigga and give me a little push. Why not? What can I lose? You yeah, yeah. So um, I tapped in with him and bro, bro, bro been helping me out a lot. You feel me? Yeah. But um, as far as like if you independent, I mean we independent. You know we trying to figure this shit out too. You yeah, feel yeah, me? yeah. But um, so you just gotta grind. You gotta grind, but but you just you gotta be that though. Right. You can't rap for real, and you know what I'm saying? Just stay out of the way. Just stay away from your time, you feel me? But, um, I mean, you just gotta, you just gotta, you just gotta make people feel you. That's how I feel, you know what I'm saying? If they can feel you, then you can do something. But, but like, you don't have days when you feel like, man, this shit ain't working. Man. All the time. Shit. That's what they need to hear, like, right. all the time. I always feel like that, because I know I put out quality music. Saying. Yeah, but you know when you put out the music, <coughs> but maybe see, I ain't doing enough to push it. For right. me, just watching it, the, the rap shit, like I don't even think like the quality music sometimes get overlooked a whole lot. Right. <coughs> so it's like it gotta they be get something. overlooked for that gimmicky shit. So it gotta be something. All right, so that was off the go. I was like, right. gotta be something else that grabs the people. Cause man, I hear a lot of people that could rap good, but they don't get. They don't get no just like nigga that do a lot of charity work. Right. Man, I ain't gonna really talk about him. Right, right. But nigga that around here robbing and shooting, they gonna, they gonna talk, they want always the negative always get the right for some reason. So that's what I'm saying. You gotta make it look good. Yeah. You gotta yeah. make it look good. <laughs> Cause imagine if you can rap and you right. looking like money. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, you can rap, but then you can put the bag behind yourself. Then right. I think I think that's you what you have to put the bag. But I think that's what a lot of people are wrong at that rap. I don't think a lot of people believe in themselves that much to put their own money behind yeah. themselves. You this know what I'm saying? Cold, like bro. most of the people that make it, like Jay Z, them, like they put the whole house up. Yeah, they put the whole house up. You, know what you, you hear a lot of niggas talk about they went broke, bro. I went broke, and that's when they blow. You feel me? But that's what you got. That's. But that's I'm not gonna lie to you. That's why I hate when niggas it. come out but with that, that money shit, bro. I know you know you got it because you try. If you working towards something, you're not yeah. supposed to have. It, but right? that's not even so. That's not just rap. That's just. As far as you make you gotta be you gotta stay broke. Like you gotta constantly invest in yourself. Like right. a million dollars cash just sitting there is, is worth it. Man, I was watching an interview with yeah, Jay Z really investing. And, and Jay said he on he was, he was like showing off money was was it was I don't even want to put the word like in there, it was like it was like he ain't really he ain't really dig it. So the dude was like, why why you not get it? He was like, because like we show our money different. Like that ain't no money. If you can show it, that ain't no money. Right, right. He was like, we brag different. So me saying that Golden State game on the on the flow, that's different. Like we do it and not meaning like the seats cost that money, just we doing you know, something. Right, doing right, something yeah, that, right. yeah, doing showing you what money can do. Yeah. Rather than showing off the money, you know what I'm saying? And he said, having money is like you pushing your brand. Like, I see your brand everywhere. And I've been (coughs) telling people that, like, if I see a person with billboards and this and that, I'm like, damn, that nigga got a brand. Because you're spending so much money on marketing. 
Mm-hmm. Like, you, you getting your shit back. But I just don't like, you know, because they, they make them jicks feel like when I come out, like when they, bro, we know you ain't got it. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? But that's that's what they see. Well, so they well, automatically well. think that not knowing, like. The internet did this. Yeah. But see, the they don't is. even know, like, they finna sign a deal to a label that only different that this label finna do that you that you ain't do, they finna put money in the market. Right. That's the only thing you ain't do. You get what I'm right. saying? Market they, stuff. Yeah, they feel, even though they got a larger bag, of course, but if you, even if you got a small, like me, I, I look at people on their levels, like, no matter what, even if an artist come in, come to me right now, and be like, hey, bro, I want to rap with you. Right. I'm going to look at what you're doing on the level that you, you right. got $20 a week. What's your shoot. budget? Not even with your budget, like, you only got $20 a week. What is you doing with that $20 right. a week? And right. you spend it, and you save a 10 of that to get in the studio next week. You know what I'm saying? Because that's going to determine, like, what you're going to do when you get more money. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, and just like, if you put it into the streets, if you see a nigga, every time he real, he go buy something, you know a nigga ain't going to last for him. <coughs> right. You know what I'm saying? But you see a nigga steady ringing up, ringing up, ringing mm-hmm. up, then you know this nigga, you hard. So you got plans, right? Yeah. You got to do something. That's really what it is, man. Right? <laughs> Bro, you got to have a plan. Yeah. Cause even if you got the money, you gonna spend the money doing it, bro. You gotta spend the money in the right place. Bro. Yeah, you can have all the money, but you don't know what you're doing with. They just gonna take that bit from you. you your time. This, and that's the thing, like a lot of niggas be like, like I ain't even impressed with niggas be like, yo, I got a million dollars. Like I, I'm saying, I'm like, I'm stuck on that Jay Z shit. Like yeah. you be like, I got a million dollars, like that shit cool. Yeah. They're like, what you doing with that million dollars? Right. You get what I'm saying? Like, like Fifty said one time, Fifty said you ain't making money until you making money in your sleep. Right. You know what I'm saying? So, like, you got a million dollars, and that's all you got. And that ain't nothing to brag about. And then go broke, and you don't have a million dollars. You yeah. know what I'm saying? But well, then you well, got this well, million well. dollars, and you don't invest this million dollars to bring in more millions. And, yeah. that's, and that's, that got my attention. Right. Right. Like, yeah, that's that's what's up. But a lot of people don't, they don't even, I know people that had a million with lawsuits and everything, and they broke today. Yeah. But mm-hmm. nothing. You know what I'm saying? So it's like you said, you gotta have a plan. I know niggas who ain't broke, but they broke. Right. Like you ride around the whole hood every day, yeah. trapping, and you got 60, 80,000. So what you, uh, you gonna do with it? Like you gonna buy you some property? Right. You gonna, like what you gonna invest in? Like what you gonna do? Yeah. But see, I look at money like. You I don't think at, like that though. And but niggas don't look at cars, money. Niggas don't look at money like opportunity. So right. every time I see people blowing money, I'm like, damn, that's a lot of money. I had 50000 designed in their closet in an apartment paying rent. You feel me? Exactly. That's a half a house. You could have built a half of a 3 2 with me and had $50,000. You could have a dunk outside of mama house and see mm-hmm. the project. Right. You hear what I'm saying? But it just, it, it really ain't, sometimes it don't be their fault. It just be the company they keep. It's it like mindset. That. Like and that's the company know. they yeah. keep. But yeah. even then, though, you can have somebody like, you could be building a house, and I can hang with you every day, and I'm getting nah, money. Right about that. But nah. I just don't see the vision, bro. Yeah, that right ain't my right plan. You but you, nah, most of the time, nah, if, you, if you had the money, you'll probably. No, nigga. I, 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 I tell my partner, bro, he didn't see me all our lives, bro. Like, he didn't see me go overseas, he didn't see me buy houses. And, was, and I'm like, damn, bro, you got to. But then when he get the bread, he didn't have the money. But see, but that's what I'm saying, but, that's, that, part, but that's a different, what I'm saying is some people just not even exposed to that to even know yeah, to yeah, do yeah. that, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, they don't have the information. Like, you know, they're not around them right. type of people. My best friend told me that, bro, man, there's a house for three to For $80,000 from the ground mm-hmm. up, built it from the ground up, yeah. you feel me? Pulled his own permits and all that. Yeah. That house just sold for two fifty, bro. Yeah, he yeah. contracted himself. Yeah. yeah, that's his ticket out the door, man. You yeah. feel me? One house, quarter million clean money. You know what I'm saying? When you see it and you pay attention to it, it's different. Mm-hmm. But a lot of people, just like I said, you can show a person, but they don't believe in themselves. Right. They're not gonna do it. You get what I'm saying? Because it just no matter what you invest in, it's entrepreneurship. You know, he ain't be afraid to move. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? 
Every country you go lose ten thousand, more than seven thousand, might lose twenty thousand. I don't know you one person. I don't know one yeah. person that is a <coughs> real baller and have it all. Take some right. balls. Only yeah. thing, take a few losses. You want to take more? You also then you take wins. Yeah. It just, it just when you take a win, you gonna it's win. Big right. You, you know what I'm saying? Because you gambling so much. It's like I'm gambling so much. So when I win, I'm gonna win big. Mm-hmm. But it's like you gonna, you gonna. So that's why I would ask you like people that starting, like what's the struggle? But you gotta go through the struggle. Yeah. You, gotta you, go, you gotta go, gotta go through it. You gotta go that through it. That's what Trick said a long time ago. Yeah. Trick said everybody wanna hustle. Everybody wanna fall, but nobody wanna struggle. <laughs> you gotta go gonna separate people though. When you gonna give up, you gonna keep on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, people just want that quick bag. Yeah. A lot of times you don't know that that quick bag don't come with experience or advice. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. When you get that slow bag, it comes with so much experience and so much advice just off your own experience. Yeah. You get know what I'm saying? So much, so much could change, like Cause you female yeah. friends, right. you get to see yeah. them yeah. at the end, but you get to go right there now, you around a whole bunch of snakes right. and more yeah. clothes, you don't even know who you're It's better when you do it gradually and learn more. Yeah, yeah. yeah. because you you grown. And you don't know how to <laughs> Exactly. Even I had 10 or 20 or 30. I ain't never know nobody who stayed on top when they had no foundation. Yeah. For real. Exactly. I didn't know niggas who done went from the bottom all the way straight to the top. Yeah. And then when they fall, they fall all the way to exactly. the bottom. Because yeah. you ain't had that middle, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying, to teach you what to do or the relationships yeah. on the way up. Yeah. I had a, I was like that, man. I was running so, so fast, so I was trying to do anything just to yeah, just, to, just to touch on her. I was yeah. a raw, raw woman. I'd do anything. That bad. That bad make it bad. But an older dude, and I know he touched millions, he told me, he was like, what, you, what, like what, what is your final goal? Like, right. like what is your final goal? Like, do you want to get this yeah. that bad and then get it and then you right. and enjoy it? Yeah, because you got so much creep shit with you. Right. You get what I'm saying? Or do you want to Get that, that shit, shit come with and, and keep that shit because mm-hmm. it's different. You you can do all that dirt, doing all that wrong right. and get it, yeah. and now it's gonna go just as fast. You get what I'm saying? Cause now yeah. all that all that karma gotta catch up to you. Got to. It's gonna catch up. Yeah. 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 One way or another. Yeah, you ain't gonna keep Child running, come. <clears throat> and when it catches, then you giving that bad right back. Go in your business, hospital bills, <clears throat> however it comes. Yeah, however it comes. You get what I'm saying? But when it you, can be on some fluke shit. So it's like now when you go through the struggle, it's like you paying your dues right. to the universe, like you paying your dues. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? You paying your dues. As long as you keep going, you gonna you gonna be due for it. That's what he said. You gonna be due for it. He away. said that would that would that would make me slow down because he said, listen, as long as you don't give up on yourself, right? The goal is always there. Yeah. Everybody, everybody get their chance. Everybody, everybody get their time. Yeah, yeah what Obi said. Obi said, man, I ain't lucky. Mm-hmm. I just, always place myself in opportunity. Like, I always prepare myself for opportunity. And that's right. Ain't no time limit either. I don't want to have to realize. Ain't no time limit. Right. Yeah. Ain't no time limit. Because you only waiting for that one W. Yeah, ain't no time limit. <laughs> like, that's with anything. But if people people just, get mapped up their life in corporate life. But ain't no time limit. You don't know where you're going. Where you going? Where you going? But, but but people, most, get discouraged, people get discouraged. People get discouraged about watching other people. I think it's, that's why I said all the time hot because you got Instagram. Yeah. I can look at this nigga, fake his win. I yeah. think he won, and now I'm down on himself. Well, that that's crazy. Back, like, shit. First thing, like people look like they right. Got it, yeah, it always looks better than it really is though. <laughs> always, right. it always look better than it really is. Right. Yeah, people get people too much credit, dog. You know what I'm saying? I think I think I think the social media you could just you, look, you got too much filter. So, so you really got too much filter. So right. it was like you could you could be sitting right here and make this bitch look like you in Hawaii. Yeah. And to the world, they really believe you in Hawaii. Do oh, it long if you do it long enough. Yeah. You ain't see they got a dude, they got a jit that had a green a green screen in the room. And he just kept posting like he was on a private jet, all type of stuff with it. But the whole time he was in the room. Yeah. And he ended up Jit was from the island. And he really, everybody that was following him, and, yeah. and he really became a man. He got a blue check, too. Yeah, exactly. 
Because everybody just <laughs> right wrong into the hype. Bad influence, bro. Yeah, and that's, that's crazy. Great dog. That's <laughs> crazy. And that would, but that's what they promoting right now. People is promoting that. Like you can listen to like most of the successful interviews and people that are trying to tell you that skin on and stuff that would teach you that. Like act like you fake it like right. You know what I'm saying? Fake it and leave it. You know, and I don't knock it to the ones that 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 got. You know, you can do it. You can, you can fake it till you make it, do it. You know what I'm saying? If that, you know, at the end of the day, if that what you, you know, your spirit could live with, <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? If you could live, you could go to sleep at night right. and be at peace with yourself yeah. like that. Hey, man, do it. Hey, you know what play a big part in this shit? Relationships, bro. Yeah, hell yeah. The right relationship. Right. It's just everything. You got to money. Money. You, see, you don't got to fake that. Right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like you can make it so far with no money if you got right like people. Right people. Right. So you got right people, you made the right people. And that's the crazy thing. Once you I heard um what's the dude what's the dude from New York? Not is it DJ Self? No, not Self. It might be Self. Is that the one that puts in the car to be at first? Yeah. 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 Yeah, he said it. He said <clears throat> I heard him doing a seminar and he said only thing he wanted to do was get to the table. Right. Fuck the money. Right. Everything else. If I can just get to that table, yeah. then yeah, like everything, everything else will make sense. I, I think people, it's hard for people out the streets to have that mindset. You feel me? Because motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? I'm not friendly shit. You know what I'm saying? But that's a Florida thing, bro. Yeah, I'm not everywhere, bro. Nah. I it's not, you, it's bro. not everywhere. It's just street. I think that's the street. Nah, nah. nah. It ain't the street. It just, uh, it's it just, here. The street yeah, I know you said you said it's San Diego and I see it. He ain't the cabinet one. Nothing for me about that shit. Yeah. Yeah. Right. I, I'm not going to lie to you. Every time I go out, I, you know, yeah. I, I mean, connect with some men. Yeah. It's, it's cool. Yeah. And if they fuck with you, they fuck. I mean, I feel like that's anywhere. If they fuck with you, they fuck with you. Yeah. If you come in there with that goofy shit, right. you know what I mean? You come in there with that fake it to you, fake it shit. <laughs> right. Yeah. You come in there with that goofy shit, you're going to get exposed. Right. Right. You feel me? So, I just think. But in that, I also think that's energy. I feel like I can go in any hood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. That I have been. Like, yeah. I ain't no could. I have right, been. Right, right. And this is that, bro. Mm-hmm. You know I'm from. You know what I'm about. Yeah. You're going to kick it. Right. I ain't even going no crazy shit. I'm going to kill. It's going to work out. I think, I think as long as you know how to carry yourself and you respect yourself, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, the thing is, a lot of niggas be too hard for themselves. Right. So it'd be a lot of that, but I think what the hood thing is like a lot of people just focus on this bad and they, they miss so much opportunity. Like me, period. Never in life have I hustled thinking about money. Right. It, it, money is for, just beautiful, for, some, right. for some reason, it distracts me when I just so focus on the money. Like it, it, it take, it take my drive. It just take the drive out of right. me because it's like you so focused on it and it's like, what if you don't make that much then? So what you gonna do? Right. You get what I'm saying? For me, it's always, and well, you know, like the demand factor. Like, what do I got? And what do people want? And that's all that matters. Can I get what they want? And then I figure the rest out. Yeah. After I figure out, can I get what right. people want? You feel know what I'm saying? But you so focused on the money, a lot of people spend so much time thinking about how to get the money. They don't even. But be, that's what they see. But they don't even be. They but they don't even be moving. Like the first time we started. If anybody did business with us our first year, we didn't take no money for nothing. We ain't even money. It was because I didn't want to, we wanted to build relationships. Like, I didn't want to build a foundation just, oh, let me take the bread. We were, no, this, this, this is about relationships because you want to build relationships so you will have somebody to call later at night and be like, hey, bro, should I make this move or that move? But if you're dealing with money, then you can't call nobody at night. So you know, <laughs> nah, they gonna want another check. They gonna be charging me for the you know, you charge me. So for the conversation, they gonna have to pay. Right. You get what I'm saying? I just learned that from Master P. Just watching him when he was doing his movies. He was saying like certain people that harassed him about money, you know, he cut their check and he let them go. He was like, but certain people that really wasn't even worried about the check, he still gave them the check. They still got him to that day. Right. And I was like, that's what I want. I yeah. would love to have Master P. Now, then be able to 
call him anytime I want. So that's how I approached the whole thing. It was like people really excited at it. And even Fifty said it when he made power. He was like, on the first episode, he didn't make no money. He was trying to yeah, sell him a pitch. No money. You get what I'm saying? But that's believe. He believed in that shit. So uh, exactly. That's it. But it's like, that's what I'm trying to tell you. Like, you got good, if you got good work, then you already know, you get what I'm saying? Like, you know your shit good, just like in the street. You got some good weed, you know your shit good, man. Your fire is good up, man. We ain't even talk about it, probably. Just hit that shit. Yeah, yeah. And then you put the number on it, because once you hit it, you're like, damn, that shit's too bad. You know what I'm saying? But now I know how to rate. To you, man. I was slow for a minute when I on that YouTube to look at it. They were like, slow down. I'm like, damn, this is slow down, really? <laughs> nah. <laughs> nah, nah. <laughs> well, nah, the name was really, I was just like, um, you know, on the hook, I was just talking about how, um, you know, how everybody did. I feel like everybody that's really in the game is trying to get out the game. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but how can you stop when your phone keep ringing? You feel me? Right. So that's what I hung with. Yeah. 
But I'm Cuban and Colombian. You know what I'm saying? So when I moved to California, it's a lot of races. At the time, now it kind of done changed, you feel me? But at the time, it's like the Mexicans do not like the blacks, you feel me? Yeah. yeah. They just and that's who I was hanging with. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Was it like Not even you, y'all. They don't fuck with each other at all. Like, yeah, the Mexicans and the blacks. Like, the Mexicans, the Mexicans be like pushing like some, they used to throw some shit up like this. NK, nigga killer. Like, yeah. and then the yeah. white boys too, they got them pecker woods out there that mean Benny. I used to be locked up in Jews in the hall. They had young white boys with swastikas tagged on their head, 15, 14, big swastikas on their back. Like, this shit like that going on, you feel me? But me hanging with all the blacks. The Mexicans ain't like that. So I used to go through it with the Mexicans a lot. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> the shout out to all my Mexicans. You know? <laughs> but now it's not, not, it shit done kind of changed. You know what I'm saying? It, changed it done lot. changed, bro. Like now it's a lot of, in Cali too, like it's a lot of Mexicans. Yeah, I think. Embracing I think, the culture. You I, feel think, I think the music brought a lot of that over there. The music did a lot, bro. Yeah, yeah. The music did a lot. But back, yeah, to, yeah. Back, back to the music. I had Believe Me in Lost Souls. Yeah, it's it's Lost. I forgot to change the name. It's the Lost Souls. I know that's a slow down. Oh, that's slow. Yeah, that's what yeah, so I'll play first. <laughs> All right, we're going to run it back. Yeah, I'm going to run it back. <laughs> <laughs> but you changed the name. Yeah, yeah, no, nah, that's the one. No, nah, that was the name of the beat. So when I made the oh, song, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> yeah, that was the name of the beat.
Slow down, man. Slow down. It's not slow down, man. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Been so light behind, it don't stop. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah. I, I, that's the first time listening to it, like just right. meditating to it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. That's him. That's 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 the vibe. People gotta be. Gotta be that word. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was gonna say that. Like people gotta, cause, cause even like Bobby said some shit. He like, man, I was sort of down. He only had eight. <laughs> You feel what I'm saying? And then the stuff, you know, you, the shit you were saying was like, like I was listening to your ball all the way from the beginning right. to, the, to the end. Like, yeah. you ain't even play like, you ain't even say nothing, even <laughs> playing with the lyrics. You like, straight talking real shit. Yeah. <laughs> you ain't even play with the lyrics. Like, you ain't even throw a punchline in there. You like, man, I'm going to talk all fast. Like, yeah. I ain't even gonna play with it. Right. But that's what you're supposed to do when you got a feature on that though, dude. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's you ain't playing yeah. with your ass. Like I said, that that one gonna be for the streets, dude. Right. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's what I'm doing it for, man. Yeah, you do it for. That's what I'm doing it for. Okay. That's what I'm doing it for. Whatever happens, happens. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to ask you, like, what's your ultimate goal, bro? Like, what's your, you know what I'm saying? Like, obviously you're investing in yourself and you putting money behind it. You know what I mean? So like, it ain't gonna take too much for me, man. If I just give you a couple bags and build a couple <laughs> houses. <laughs> oh, good, bro. You feel me? Yeah. It ain't gonna take much. Right. Yeah. It ain't gonna take much to make me happy. You feel me? Right. Now but of course, of course, the goal is to make some money off this. You know what I'm saying? Of course. But lately, I've been seeing you turning up, though. Yeah, yeah. I've been seeing you, like, keeping your foot on the gas. Yeah, like, I got to stop playing. I played for too long. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's, that's the thing that I've been like, man, we gotta get him on the show, man. Yeah. I seen you, seen you putting your foot on the gas, so it's like, Put them under the lights so right, everybody right, start right. watching. Yeah, yeah. And everybody start watching. Yeah. I got a plan for this year. I'm right now, you know, I'm just doing a video with a song every month this year. I'm yeah. gonna just throw a couple songs out, probably like a song in between without a video. But for sure, it's gonna be a hard ass song with a hard ass but, video. But, this, but the city know you. There's a lot of people in the city I be seeing, I be seeing them like when you be posting your 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 um the raps and the cars and stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah, that's my strong point. Mm-hmm. That's my strong point. That bitches go crazy. I know, I'm like, bro. Hey, on my Bible, that bitches go crazy. Yeah, yeah, they yeah, love yeah. that shit. They be, they be on They love that shit. So it's like, yeah. it's like, you going dumb. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I watched a few of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They love yeah, that shit. Okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> that bitches go crazy. Yeah. They love when I give them that. <laughs> yeah. On my mom. Because you don't got. The, the reason why, man, we don't got too much rap that feed you content. Right. So it's like when people hear content in the rap. some substance in it. Exactly. Yeah. It's like niggas are so thirsty for it, niggas are going to drink the whole bottle. Right. But I even catching the wind. You going to make some, like, real club shit? Yeah, I have to. I have to. You know what I'm saying? I have to. I got something to cut that I, I feel like club music. Sometimes don't even really be club music, bro. Once you build that buzz, they can play anything, bro. And them people fucking with it, they can play it in the club. The, the thing that he told me about, see them jits, them jits ain't listening to the nah. to the lyrics. They just nah. wanna they wanna they just wanna they just wanna they 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 wanna but it has such a California feel to it. Right. I feel like if I would have been in California when they I dropped that video, it would have went dumb. Right. I would have been out of here already. You feel me? I would have been gone. But why would why would you why would you still go home and drop it? I go back then. Or you could just drop you know it and go out there and push right. it and go home. They still be fucking with me back back over there. You feel me? You know, what, what that damn they be doing that crunk. They be doing that crunk damn and they crunk there, right? Yeah, that shit was like a little phase. It was yeah, like, they ain't doing that. Talk about that Tommy Clown shit. Yeah. That yeah, no, nah, that shit was just a phase back then. Then they had like the jerking shit. Niggas was jerking. That jerk music, that shit was, that, that shit was a wave. That's when niggas started wearing skinny jeans and shit. I don't wear that shit though. Niggas was gang jerk, banging the skateboard. Yeah. You don't know about the jerk shit? Yeah, they was doing that shit in Florida too though. 
Yeah, I, I, I don't know. I don't know if I ever seen anybody there. Right? Yeah, that was so that's so that's so cool. Yeah, you know, Orlando was dancing. Yeah, that was cool. That was cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. I feel like you just gotta, you know, you can still pop your shit. Yeah. You know what I mean? Just that vibe. Just, it's, it's really the beat. Yeah, the beat, that's all it is. It's really the beat. I think, I think, I think D-Day, you gotta get in the club yeah, you to, got really, to really get. Or what a little bit more. Huh? What? <laughs> to, really, to really get your your vibe going. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Because, like, <laughs> your gravitate towards everything else. Nah, it's just the 18th. From the 16 to the 25 is what really moved social media. So right. it's like, if you ain't touching that crowd, your number, and you can, like I said, you're going to go back to what I'm saying. You got good music, right. but your numbers ain't going to look right. right. You get what I'm saying? They're going to be like, well, that nigga hard, but like, your numbers ain't right. going to match up. Right. Yeah. So you get what I'm saying? Right. But when you touch that 16 to 25, they, that's all they do is on yeah. That's all they do. Right. They make something go by with that. Yeah, for real. Like you said, a nigga blowing in the breakfast line. Yeah. Make that shit go by. Yeah. Yeah. Anything go by. Anything goes. Anything goes. Anything goes. Anything goes. Anything goes. Anything goes. And I feel like they're the ones that make TikTok do what they do. Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah, the gist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They make TikTok do what they do. So it's like. But you got to get the gist on screen. Uh, once you get done too behind, it's over. Right? <laughs> yeah. Really? Really? Yeah, fuck the dude. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I hate Unless you hit the white, you know. Yeah, the other people. Yeah, you gotta get the other people. <laughs> you gotta get the other people. <laughs> yeah, you gotta get them too. Gotta get the other people for real. Yeah, yeah, you gotta get. Yeah, yeah, that's gonna do it. You gotta get the Fox Talk people, man. You gotta get everybody, man. Yeah. Hey, man, what the fuck y'all think about it? Capital shit, bro. Man, I'm gonna let you get some brown and some black folks, man. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot of dead, motherfuckers. They said they said they supposed to be taking over. They said the future taking over. Oh, yeah, not here. Not here. <laughs> no, no, no. You don't think they gonna do it here? I feel like they didn't try. They gonna do that shit in Virginia and Alabama and little Raiders, Pop State, so like out over the people. Yeah. Well, they said it oh, was police and everything off duty. Yeah. That joke was crazy when they was at the airport. That shit got real for a lot of people. Oh, yeah. <laughs> was at, at the airport, they like, no flight list. What the fuck? And they'll take that ass to jail. But I feel like they stupid records. Y'all ain't even really dead nothing. They let y'all walk in. When niggas, when niggas be protesting shit, we already be having the U.S. the marshals, the, the riot squads, the Nigga got to get through all that shit just to even, you know what I'm saying? Ain't going to get through it. Ain't going to get through it. They let the motherfuckers walk in. That shit was. I feel like that shit pushing man. I think, I think they. That shit was the inside. I think that shit was the stage. I think they wanted that. Yeah, ain't no, ain't no way, bro. Ain't no way. They let them people go on there. They got one black people like, get back. You got the black people out there. They going to pull the bus on the front man. He knew that he knew he was the best one in the joke. He would have been the only one out of all the crazy <laughs> young shit. He was like, he he was that nigga was he trying to live he live to say that never paid you. That nigga trying to say another paycheck. He didn't say he thought about it at first, but he see the first furry ass one to grab that hill. And that nigga said, nah. <laughs> nah, <laughs> well, I gotta see another picture. That nigga pulled out a stick. He back. Yeah. Man, that's, nah, man, that, that shit, shit crazy. Crazy world, dog. Yeah, man. I'm talking about 2001 coming in with a, with a bang already. Like, that shit, that was, that shit, that was crazy. I don't, I don't even know what to think about it. Like I said, that shit all seemed fake to me. Until like, I don't even seem real, man. Like, man, Until you start seeing their ass go to jail. Like, right. they caught their ass, like, after the fact. It was a firefighter from Sanford. They had one move. Nigga, they had a um a a a sheriff from Pinellas. But how they had the dude that was running with the podium. How they had the dude with the and shit. Yeah. Group chat, go out here. Yeah. Tighten up. Yeah. 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 Y
Trump, 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 <laughs> it didn't happen. But I'm talking about they got Trump boosting them up right now, but that shit might happen, boy. Yeah, uh, man, I'm boy will come through this bit with some artillery, boy. They yeah. might be ready, boy.
you're watching him for real. That, that's what makes him grow up. That's all right, man. I'm going to get you out of here, man. I got time, man. We got, a, um, we got another song. Oh, yeah, I believe. Yeah. I believe. That's the roll of dice. That's the roll yeah, of dice. Yeah, they okay. get the right away. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 All the wrong ladies. <laughs> <laughs> That was the name of the beat. <laughs> <laughs> so that's, the one, that's the one you said. Yeah, they got a beat. They got a video for it out right now. Man. But but that's the one you said. Like yeah, that's, that's my, my favorite song. song. Right. That's my favorite song. So we gonna come yeah, back or we gonna? Nah, we gonna end it. Go ahead and hold us up. Get it right in there. Yeah. All right. All right. So yeah, we gotta get Chico out of here, bro. That man got important business, man. Appreciate you coming through. Right. Let, them know, let them know where they can find you at again, bro. Like all your music, you know, the whole platform. Y'all uh, follow me on Instagram at underscore O N E C H I K O. And um, the music everywhere. Just look up One Chico. It's everywhere. YouTube, Apple Music, Spotify, Amazon, wherever. You feel me? Man, there it is, man. Do what you want to do. Radio, man. We out of here. Oh, <laughs> 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 <laughs>